Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a curl former set and to start off I will be using the Mixed Tricks Curl Wash to cleanse my hair. This curl wash has jojoba oil and castor oil and is great for helping to remove impurities, detangling your hair while leaving it hydrated. It's a no lather product so it can be a little tricky to use because you're tempted to use a lot because you're expecting it to lather up but it's definitely no lather so you just want to use the same amount that you would with any other conditioning product and it definitely did make my hair feel very moisturized and I could see that my scalp was clean afterwards so I really liked using this co-wash and it also helped in detangling as well so I really have no complaints about this product. Next, I'm going to be using the Daily Hairdress as my leave-in and this is an oil-infused cream that helps to rejuvenate dry hair. And to style, I'll be using a combination of the Morning After Hair Foam and the Curl Sculptor Gel. I really liked these products together. They worked really well and I also love the fact that they had quite a bit of slip and made my hair feel very soft and moisturized. So now I'm going to install the flexi rods and they are plastic bendable hair curlers and you have to just push that stick inside of it and then you put the hair inside the little hoop that's at the top and pull it through the rods and that's it. Another thing I want to mention too is that these are the original curl formers because curl formers is a brand and they are way more expensive than these guys. I bought these on Amazon. I want to say they're like a maybe four dollars for a dozen or something it's very cheap super cheap um but the original curl formers cost a lot and they are sold on amazon and i think they probably have their own website so if you're looking to try these you probably want to try the dupes first like i did and like i said you can get them on amazon ebay maybe aliexpress any of those chinese websites so the thing I don't like about curl formers is the fact that once you pull your hair through the curl former with the hook, then the ends get messed up. So they aren't perfectly straight or smooth as they would be if you were like smoothing them out, adding extra product and wrapping them on a perm rod. It's like once you pull it through, you have no control over how they end up looking. So I don't like that and I think that's why my ends look a little bit dry. Also, I need a trim like I said before, but definitely I liked the style somewhat, but I probably wouldn't be revisiting curl formers anytime soon. So I'm pretty sure these rods would be very difficult to sleep in so I just went under my dryer for an hour and they were pretty much dry when I came out. So to remove the curlers you're just going to squeeze the top part open and then you're able to just gently glide the curler off the hair. Overall, I really love this entire Mixed Tricks line. I found that the morning after mousse really worked well with the curl sculpture to really define my curls. One thing I do realize is that I had a little bit of flaking and I think that's because I went a bit overboard with the amount of products I used. So next time I'll definitely tone down on that. Mixed Tricks has sponsored a giveaway. So all you have to do is be subscribed to my channel Give this video a thumbs up and in the comment section let me know what you like most about having natural hair and that's it so the winner will be announced on tuesday november 21st on my instagram stories so be sure to head over to my instagram page so you'll be able to find out if you've won this prize also i will be selecting three winners and this competition is open to everyone in the us and canada So if you guys like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate each and every one of you guys. I want to thank you so much for watching this video. I do hope you found it helpful. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave those in the comment section and I'll definitely reply.
So I hope you guys entered the giveaway. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!